Hello, welcome back to War Another Week, Monday, 8 a.m. Okay, let's start another week, and uh, this time I'm on, on the mood for videos, because actually they are more productive um, to reach the, 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 the public than actually, you know, writing, publish, publishings. So actually, I'm just gonna 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 talk about a little bit of um, where to find radioactive. Uh, when uh, this is the ones that that I actually have at home. I'm gonna start by um, Minolta camera from my dad. This is this was bought in 1969. Uh, okay, this this Minolta camera on the lens has something called thorium 232, which is radioactive. Um, while you can read it on a Wikipedia, it is a natural element of radioactive. Actually, this 232 is a um, um, processor, um, a, um, a processor of uranium, enriched uranium. So actually, this is like you know a waste from the the nuclear reactors. Uh, as you see, if you look inside the lens, you have a blue color. Uh, the blue color is is the, the thorium. Uh, you have actually to dismantle this lens. Um, this is usually made by f professional photographs, um, but um, this this really act actually has about uh, zero dot six milligrams of thorium, which which um, emits uh, half a, half a, half a, and and gamma rays. Um, and by inhalation, you, you get in, infected with radioactive. Um, question is, if you put it in open air, this is too, too much small quantity to, to have a, no, a, a blast. Anyway, about the nuclear bomb, and one of, the, one, of the, one of the aspects of the nuclear bomb is that to reach more than 50,000 Fahrenheit degrees, which means this acts inside an airplane or wherever you put it, it has to be inside... Um, a room and pr pr and and preferable and see um, with 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 a, a hot environment, so um, this has a, a lot of a lot of um, uh, w um, ways to use it, um, but this is just to show you the um, the source. Thanks for watching.